Money is leaving California at an unprecedented pace. Investors are flocking to the Midwest to pick up deals like this one. And that's what we're going to talk about. This is your show. This is the show where I work for you directly, taking your needs. I'm going through the MLS and I'm trying to find the best possible deal for you guys. Put down 25%. That's the perfect way to buy this. That's why real estate investing is the greatest industry in the world. Hey guys, welcome to another episode of the MLS Search Analysis Show. You're watching Holton Wise TV and I'm your host, James Wise. And I want to talk about California people buying deals like this in the Cleveland market and other cheap markets, right? Money, money in California is just flowing out of that state right now, man. The ridiculous prices of real estate, the insane overtaxation, man. It's out of control right now. And a lot of that led my newest client, a man named Jeff, an investor living in California. You work in tax preparation, so you know all about the overtaxation out there, brother. Uh, you recently reached out to me. Uh, you have a $150,000 budget, right? That's what you want to do, right? You're approved for $150,000 of loans. You'd like to do some deals out here in the Cleveland market. Get your portfolio started. So you did the smart thing. You reached out to my team, sales at HoltonWise.com. You gave us your phone number. We talked to you. We got the information that uh, makes you tick, right? We got your budget, your wants, your needs, your goals, and now we're working together, right? You ordered three shows for me, and I'm going to knock all three of those out for you today jeff the first one is this particular property dude it's a side-by-side -side duplex i love side-by-side -side duplexes my favorite type of duplex because the tenants typically stay longer right somebody's not above or below you and they're bigger we get more rent longer tenancy things of that nature so i love those As a matter of fact i love those so much i sent this to another investor a few days ago, uh, we sent him a whole pack of uh, properties to move forward on as well. And uh, what, because what I like to do, right? I like to give you guys options, man. I like to give you guys a couple to pick and choose from, compare and contrast. He liked a couple of the other deals. We moved forward on those, thus meaning this one's still available. And I think it's going to be a great one for you to look at, Jeff. So, first, I want you to take a look at that financial analysis. This is a side by side duplex, and I freaking love side-by-side -side duplexes guys the majority of our housing stock just so you guys are aware when we're talking duplexes in this market it's typically an up down but the side-by-sides are so much better for two reasons one they're typically bigger two it's just a better build right the tenants they don't bother each other as much being on top of each other or below each other you don't get as many noise complaints they don't fight as much they typically have separate basements so what that means is the tenants are just happier and when your tenants are happier, they stay longer. When they stay longer, we make more money as real estate investors, right? So whenever we get the opportunity to look at a side-by-side, -side, I always want to see you guys take it down. Now, we only have one photo here, okay? That's all we got. The address, it's 10413 Bernard, Cleveland 44111. It's been on the market almost two months, listed at 119000 I believe that price is a little bit too high. And Joe, in the previous videos I've done for you, we focused on houses that need some work, a little bit of work to them before we can get them tenant occupied. This one, already tenant occupied. We don't even have to do anything to this one. So I thought I'd bring it to your attention. I know you wanted to try to do some bird deals, but with my goal of keeping you out of highly distressed neighborhoods, you have to understand the opportunity to do bird deals is going to go down, right? Because the less blight in issues in the areas, the more likely the properties are to be in good condition and the less likely you're going to have a totally distressed seller, right? And because of what you've been telling me, I wanted to make sure I didn't put you in any like D-class neighborhoods or anything, right? So with each of these units, they're both 3-1. We're getting seven fifty and six fifty, so that's fourteen hundred a month, sixteen thousand eight hundred a year, and these are actually eight hundred twenty-five dollar a month units. Um, but I want to explain that to you, right? We got to get into some uh, like heavy details on how the city of Cleveland and the Division of Water operate, right? I'm gonna bring your attention to this chart here, okay? This is my normal chart that I put out for you guys in all these videos where I break down anticipated expenses. Now, I want to take your attention down to the water sewer. As you see, it's zero, zero, 
All right, zero for the month, zero for the year, and I put a little asterisk there. Normally, on a duplex unit, you guys see me estimate the cost of $75, okay? The reason I do that is because the way we run our portfolio at Holton Wise is we have the owners pay the water sewer bill on behalf of the tenants because the water sewer bill runs with the land. If they don't pay it, right, it gets tacked onto your tax bill and actually evicting these people for a partial non-payment, which that's what it would be if they didn't pay the water sewer bill. It's a freaking nightmare. It's so much of a nightmare uh, that I have a whole fact on HoltonWines.com dedicated to the water sewer issue. So I don't want to like burn any more time in this show for you, Joe, uh, but I do want you to check out the water sewer uh, information we have on our property management fact for more information on why we make all of our owners pay the water sewer bill and not put it onto the tenants. Lenders, our investors are looking to work with you. Send us an email at sales at holtonwise.com to be part of our referral network. This particular landlord, little mom and pop landlord, they probably don't understand how inefficient and how much risk they're putting themselves at by making the tenants pay it because these are separately metered. Uh, so they're renting their unit at 750 and then the tenants have to pay their water sewer bill. So when Holton Wise were to take something like this over, we would just get a new lease, have the rent become eight and a quarter and then there'd be no water sewer bill for the tenant right so that's market rent eight and a quarter the other one would be a hundred bucks less would be seven and a quarter but we're pretty damn close to market rent right so six to one half dozen to the other right is it eight and a quarter with 75 in water or is it 750 and they pay the water right it's still going to amount to the same projections here right which is an noi of 814 or 9768 for the year i think this property is worth 100, a cool 100 Gs, man. You buy this for 100 Gs. That's a 9.8 cap. You don't have to do any repairs. I don't want to see you come in cash. I want to see you just come in with financing, right? Just put down 25%, get the bank to loan you the other 75, and it's actually a 23.9% cash on cash return. Welcome back, Jeff. So let me know your thoughts, man. If you think this is one of the ones you want to move on, we can absolutely do that. You just reply to this email and we will write up the offer for you. But I always want to give you options, right? Because I'm going to do three of these for you. And based upon your budget, I think you'll be able to knock down two of them. So I like to give you some backup plans. So I'm going to film your second one right now. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.